Hey guys, Mark Poole here, and welcome to The Walking Dead. Let's continue the journey of getting a battery, getting Clementine's uh, study books right here. And, uh, um, where's that, uh, uh where's Waldo book? Right. Sorry if you're annoyed, that's my dog. And conquering Molly's heart so I can get in that boat. <laughs> I, I don't know why. <laughs> Am I walking in circles? I've been talking to Clem before I go, right? Just make sure, Clem, make sure uh, you uh, stay close, Ben. Yeah. Well, what's wrong? This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it. Oh, yeah, man. It's been five years since I've been in school. <laughs> Me too. I used to be a teacher, remember? Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom. Just you and me. Will there be homework? No <laughs> homework. Yay! Do you think I hate homework. Will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? Uh, mother. No. Yeah. It may take a while, but yeah, I do. Don't you? And according to the games. <laughs> you hold on to that hope. Or the episodes in uh, the live action one. But then again, I never seen the episode, so. Uh, I'm the live action ones. The AMC one? ACM? I don't know. I only saw the first episode. That's it. In the webisode, the uh, one with the bike girl, I think that was her name. I don't know. What is it? Ah! It's a lot of blood! It's a lot of blood! Let's get the out alleyway here. to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? I'm going, beautiful. Jeez Louise got the bones gorgeous. Oh you're so gorgeous, baby. Okay, press R8, right, so think of a good joke. Um door to the alleyway. I'm infected with a virus before I die. Maybe touch your butt. <laughs> no. That's not a pickup line, that's a section on the window. God damn it, I can't think of any good jokes to tell her. Hey, Molly, uh, normally that uh, Molly, pickaxe Molly, wouldn't look good at anyone but you. That makes you look hot. <laughs> I, I don't know. Me. I'm going to be the Howard Wallowitz in this episode, all right? I'm going to conquistador her. Auto motors. Pull what was that, man? Uh, or something. Con. Ooh, I don't like that. Ooh, okay. All right, let's open it. Hey! Yeah, God damn it, not strong enough. Damn, it's jammed tight. <laughs> I got that. My. Can I move? Okay, so. Ooh, boy. He <laughs> just sit there. Molly! Baby! You and Molly. Leave Who are him. you? He's mine. Nice to see you. So hey Molly, uh so wanna get to Molly? <laughs> Molly! What? 
I think you got it. One more. He's wearing medical oh school. Right? Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Baby, are you okay? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Not a problem. Look what I found. Awesome! How you carry that thing in your book bag? Ooh. We did too much noise anyway. Ooh, boy. Sorry, hair fell out. Ugh. That was nasty. Anyways, uh, bye! Let's get out of here. I'm going, Molly. I heard you're a lava her. Let me show you something more. I'm a flood of love to love. Ah, he's alive. Molly, you did a terrible job. I, I, it's called a double tap rule, but you didn't double tap at all. You just punch a tap. Yeah. <laughs> Dumb persons. Dumb sound bits. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Oh, I'm taking a good look around. <laughs> Woo wee. That's a delicious. Uh use. No power. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Okay, how about you? You have it? <coughs> Excuse me. Nope, no battery. You. Um. Can I borrow Something your pickup thingy? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda. That's Hilda. what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow nah, I, I will not judge you ever, you baby. Get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. I will scratch you. Something you need? <laughs> yeah. What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop. Tried to take a bite out of me. So I took care of business. What, you got a problem with me killing geeks? No, it no, just baby. seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was just making sure. Look, you want to get this battery or not? Time's wasting. I kiss you. You're beautiful. I'm going to have a look around. You do that. Oh, my love. <laughs> uh, picture. I don't know how those things work. Why would oil decrease the thing? Whoa, whoa! Woo, boy! No shit! Uh, <laughs> you think? I'll try to hold well, it would be Hurry. just a good idea to just kick the thing off. Finally, something goes right. Uh, okay. Got that one off! Good. Now, no more noise. Uh, God damn it, come on. Get, get, this, get this thing off quickly. I would have used both hands. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Okay. Okay, follow me. Boy. Move your ass. Oh, I want to move yours instead. But I have a good idea. No, I should move it. Move these two butt cheeks right here. Ooh, shake it, shake it. Now what? Let's make love one last time. Skylar. What about it? Oh yeah. I'm thinking about you. Okay, I'm sorry. Oh, I didn't mean for that. Ah, <laughs> uh, help. Ooh. Wait, was that the 
the the confederacy 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 whatever that South flag. I can't think of the name confederal confederal confederacy. Whatever that flag was used in Civil War. I don't know. I'm I'm too tired to think right now. I can't remember Dragon Tales. So I can't remember that. Stop complaining. Come on. I'm sorry. God, I was hot. <laughs> Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump. Nobody calls me chicken. <laughs> Wrong button. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry, Molly. <laughs> Look at me like that. <clears throat> and that voice. <laughs> okay, so now we're on a roof. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! I don't know, man. Woo! Yeah! I made it this time, boys! God damn it, low screen! Maybe I should do this. Save time! You know, for a couple seconds, but still. Compress the video as much as possible, you know. <laughs> later, something I gotta do first. What? B Catch you later. Baby, what? I thought we were connecting. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly. God damn it! What the hell is she doing? But baby, I love you. Uh, god damn it. I don't think I can do nothing with that one. I uh, guess I go back to clamp. I don't remember. Little huh? help here! Ah. <laughs> Ooh wee! And the head is stuck. Ow. The doors won't Ow. close all the way. I heard do something. I heard something. Here sucks down. I'm going. Three. Don't you worry, all right? Don't you worry about thing, girl. Don't you worry about thing. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about thing. Damn well, bad. I was. I mean, it's glass, so I wouldn't. One, two, three, four, five. We got the fuel. Let's not start high fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. With these Ooh, few that Wait, glass is breaking. Time. I don't like the glass breaking. It's terrible. Terrible job. Terrible Steve Jobs. Where's my thing? Oh, there it is. Uh, my flash drive, so I can get the yeah. game out of the we made out system. Good too. Great work, hmm. Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has. Yeah. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. She will be. Can't, uh, Clammy? How you doing? Are you okay, Clem? Yeah. Where's Molly? She had to go run an air. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She will be. She's, pretty she's tough. beautiful. Just sit tight, okay? I need to go take care of a few things. All right. All right. Let's go to the medicine now. Excuse me. I burp.
<laughs> I don't know what I was doing. Uh... We're back. Save some time, but at least whatever time. I hate the loading screens. It takes so long. And then it, it comes awkward too. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten zombies. Tomahawk chop? I don't know. This is dangerous stuff. Oh boy! One second every day, one second never enough. Oh, shoot the well, whatever. Uh, you killed my brother. Oh, boy. Woo, woo, woo. God damn, sensitivity sucks. Oh, hopefully, in the other games, they spark sensitivity out. With Confederacy? Confederacy flag! That was the word I was looking for. Oh my god, my memory sucks. Hey! It's me. The hell happened? I walk in open doors. They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. <coughs> I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the mids? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Looks like they were keeping oh, all the prescription meds in that safe. <coughs> locked up tight. You see. There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time. But I don't know how much of that we have. Yeah, hell of a lot. We have There's about a four digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and forty minutes for us to find. We should just try busting it open. Ish. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Hmm. No tape inside. Damn it. Uh, I think it's here, if I remember. Anna Correa. I guess she must have been a patient here. <clears throat> and what's this? You guys remember that? I do. I, I I have a camera like that still from my parents. And not I don't own my parents do, but uh um, I'm not trying to game me that for to but make YouTube Christ it. I'm like, uh mom that this cannot the work. Since the outbreak, fifteen forty seven, Doctor Logan in consultation with patient Logan, huh? Are you Why are you recording this? Regulations. Ooh, you're the doctor, huh? Records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell hmm. them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this, but I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Oh boy. I mean, yes and no, I agree with it. Damn it. I mean, not the termination of the kid. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said. No, that's far from what I meant. Lee, from maybe there's this kill kid. kid. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the other side. Yeah, damn it. Maybe you should search it, see what he's got on him. But what I meant was same thing with what we're pursuing right now that's happening to Krista with the, all the signs. It's definitely not a good time to. Uh, I mean, you could, but 
Try not to squish in there. So that way, no baby comes out. Because it's not a great time to have a child in the zombie apocalypse. Especially when it's one, two, three, four, five years old. Because they're going to be crying. And baby cannot tell them to shut up. Right, this isn't gonna be like a a quiet place. Oh, Ooh, so sorry. We're gonna keep the kid in the bur in the shoe box with oxygen tanks and all that, so he can breathe. It's too much work. Don't terminate the kid. I'm definitely, that's far from what I meant. Jesus. Ah, Jesus. Save some time. Now, let's go get that medical scrubs, which i never seen scrubs. My sister has. I haven't. I didn't care much for scrubs. I don't know. I care for house. I like house. Oh! You son of a bitch. You scare me. Oh! Oh! Oh man. Those things are heavy. I remember I used to have one. The big ones, you know? <coughs> Excuse me. Mm, boy, you're so alive, aren't you? Persistent little fuck. I'm near you. Hey. We're gonna do the stomp around. Ow! Let me search your pockets, man. This might be just 82. What need. What's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Ooh, 630 something. Shit, time to go. I'm a zombie, it's not you, so don't care about you. I don't shoot me. <laughs> That's how it works, right? I don't know. Ooh, boy. Damn, no, the screen takes forever. Ah, oh, this time I didn't cut it, huh? <laughs> how you doing, guys? I love you so much. Um, Yes, guys, please subscribe, like, comment, share. I'm going to be seeing that for the next couple of videos, because... I've watched the uh, analysis slash how many views per video is and all that, and it's going down. I'm yelling timber. I'm moving fast. I'm moving slow. I don't know this song at all. <laughs> so, shoot. But yeah, um. This one's dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. But yeah, the videos haven't been doing good as I will hope they would be. Have you made a decision? So, I thought you said help, I didn't please. have a choice. I would appreciate well, it. Technically, please. you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. <coughs> Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes? If this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now... Bad times. <laughs> I'm here, huh? No. Oh, man. No. Oh boy. So that's how I started. The zombie apocalypse. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. 
That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell. Maybe out. she realized what she meant. Like, it's not really. Well, it was before the apocalypse. I wouldn't blame her, but antibiotics, morphine. I'll take as much of this um, as you can carry. Yeah. Okay. Uh, same. Same. This is more. Than I get time to have a baby. Mine. Let's go. You go on ahead. I want to make sure we didn't miss anything. I'll be right behind you. <gasps> Ooh, I forgot I to get the. I won't. I forgot the code. I wanted to see what was that code. Alright, then. Let's see. What's in this tape? No tape inside. I... Huh? Oh. <laughs> Wrong button. Alright, then. Let's see. Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking <laughs> down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Well, shit. So, that happened. She got extra medicine for her sister by Oh boy, I'm not gonna joke about her say nothing. Yes, uh, I got Molly. <laughs> I thought you love me. Uh God damn I'm stuck. What oh my god, what's wrong with the controllers now? Oh Molly! Scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that. I know what you did, oh, Molly. Yeah, uh, about that. What about it? I'm just kidding. I still love you, though, Marley. You know what you did Here with you the go. doctor. I was disgusted, but I still love you. As much as Kenny, but I love you both. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the act, Molly. <clears throat> I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on Everybody. the tape. They saw me right there and told me about it. I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret, kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked, how anything was better than becoming one of them, but I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could Worse have seen it before it was too late, before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. 
It's one sixteen. I don't know. <laughs> It's 2.16. Oh, 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 hey! Sorry, I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He set me up to look for how long does it to bust it open. Take to Found open this. the door! Ben, where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. Oh, no. Shit! Ben, you idiot! God, you're sexy like that. God, he's hot. Oh! Thanks. It wasn't me. Good going, kid. Nice shot. Nice, Scott. And there's something wrong with the audio. <laughs> I tried to move it, but no, it didn't want to work like that. It wanted to fight me. It wanted to protect me. It wanted to love me. And goddamn, this loading screen sucks. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. <laughs> oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn, damn you! How many times are you gonna fuck up today? This is my fault, all my fault. The hell's he babbling about? Always been your fault. We talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? The zombies right now. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I opened the door. I let them in. Damn. We don't have time for this now. I'm sorry, we. I can't do this anymore. He's got a right to know. Know what? It's been me all along, putting all of us in danger. Oh. Katja and Duck, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep it off our <laughs> backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... <laughs> Kitty man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. We gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can warm his skinny little ass later. But right now, we gotta go! Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not Fine, big okay. enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omi, and you put that at risk. Who says you're gonna be on the boat? Don't I get a vote? Eh, yeah, sure, Clint. Of course you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. We don't leave friends behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. Don't look at me like what that clown. The rest of us, don't we get a second? No. I barely met you, and you tried to kill me earlier. And you're dead now. Now can we go? Damn right. Yes, we can, baby. Come on. What about the rest of us? Don't we get? Do Do you know our group? Do you know my name? Do you know Clementine's story? No? Now let's sit down and talk about it. Clementine was a young girl who lived in the tree. One day, a man came to town and said, Hey, you got so some soup. Armory. What's left of it? And, a few um... Rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door. Yeah, yeah. I couldn't. The lock was busted. Pretty 
great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. I want to go up. Uh, that's why I want to do it. Woo! Hey, how you doing? Uh, uh, <laughs> it's not going to hold. Back upstairs. Oh, man. Ooh. Shotgun! Oh, I love shotguns! Thank you, Kenny! You know me! It's like the back of your back! Ooh, boy! Hey, how you doing? Ah, back away, back away! Back away now! No, no! Don't touch me there! Get out of my normal square! I'm gonna look up. Hey, what's up? I'm gonna get this up. And I'm gonna. Oh! Hey, no. Oh. You get heat. I just said that loud, didn't I? I I'm gonna censor. I, in fact, I already censored that. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh, what? Yeah, damn it. There we go. Oh my god, I don't know what happened. I kept dying a bunch of times because the sensitivity sucks in this thing. Thank you. Ooh, badass time. Hey, get off my plane. Hey, kid, get off my plane. Oh, you're ugly. You're not Molly. You're too fat. Woo, boy. Bye-bye. <laughs> Come on. I'm going. Hug time. It's, all right, it's always a good for a hug. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into Damn. town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? That's how we go. attract a lot of zombies. <laughs> that one sounds like he's choking on, on the water. Let's go. Hey, Owen, or whatever your name was. Ooh, shotgun to the face. Uh oh. Hold on, Ben. I've got you. Uh, oh. Come on, you can do it. Decision, decision, decision. I'll explain later. I'll explain later. And don't tell me, oh my god, you decided to kill Larry. You decided to leave Lily. But Ben, I don't know, he stays. Even though he was kept saying, he's a fuck up, he's an idiot and all this. I'll explain later. And no, it's just because I have knowledge of the se the second season. The second season. The second the second episode coming up soon. Okay. I'll explain okay. to you why I chose this. Even when I first played this. You'll see why. And I love you. Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I've been screaming all day. Hey. Back already? 
I mean, you were asleep. You medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. No water? We need water to drink those medicines now. You look worse than I do. Probably. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? I'll talk about it later, uh, Kenny boy. I got work to do. Okay, with a little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. What do you want to talk about? Listen, about what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. There was nothing you could have done. No, so you don't care about the death. You want to All know right, the awesome. worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends... That's how I am with people and breakups and loss of friendships and everything bad in my life. Like this is what our world... True story, I'm not joking about it, actually. Um, I just get used to it, really. To me about? As Dr. Train says, he's an old friend of mine. Anyone can see Just true. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. <coughs> She'll be safe with us. Safer than Shut she will be if she stays with fuck. you. I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. Fuck that little girl's in my yeah. care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Don't test me, old man. I don't care. Dare say those words of take you climb away ever. You should ever do that again. Not only will I slap you, I will kiss you in the mouth, and then I'll shoot you in the face. Honey? Hey, going somewhere? Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. Huh? What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Thought you were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded. And I never did like the water. I love sure the water. I'm sure. I've always done better on my own anyhow. Baby. Listen, I love you. I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the <laughs> she broke all her thing. Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. No kiss? La chica list? <laughs> Why don't they always love me? I just... Be sure to take care of that little girl. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. Ain't nothing to do with luck. True. So about beauty in that ass. God, I love her ass. <laughs> That's the last time I'll see her. <laughs> uh, Clem, we gotta talk. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. Oh, yeah. What are we going to do? 
After he fixes it, where will we go? In the ocean, get some water, get some fishing. We'll go wherever Kenny says. He's a good captain, and he knows the water's down south. He'll know where to take us. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same <coughs> since he got back. Well, he's been through a lot, Clem. He's just gotten a little overwhelmed, that's all. I'm sure he'll be fine. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. <sighs> hey there. Shh. It's okay. It's okay. Don't cry. Dead. I mean, I could have had it earlier, but in mean, the train was set there. I think I said the option. The parents are dead, but duck died, catch died. I don't think that would be a great time to talk about that. <sighs> Clementine. Clementine? Clem? Ooh, it's quiet. Too quiet. I don't like that! <laughs> Okay, that was Clementine. somewhat noisy. Clementine! Oh, God. One second, guys. Sorry about that. Almost an hour, you know. <clears throat> where, where did Clem go? Why would she leave her hat? Hello? Okay, this time I'm cut to the jaw is all it takes, okay, huh? Episode. Out here. It ain't safe. Lee, where's Clementine? She's not in her room. <clears throat> Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Help. Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? 
We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. I don't know how much time I have now. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. <sighs> I'm getting emotional. Because <laughs> I remember what happens. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Thanks. Uh, I didn't. I like you, me. I didn't like you that much as Chris, so I take it back. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine, and I am a Christian man. But I keep asking myself, if this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Because there've been plenty of times when you ain't been. I have been all the time. Kenny, you know what Clementine means to me. She's my family now. She's all I got. Hell, in the end, family's all that matters. And you were there for Katja and Duck when it mattered most, I guess. All right, I'm in. What about you, Ben? Now hold on a damn minute. I'm not going if this little shitbird is too. Lee, you want to bring Clementine back alive, you'll leave him behind. Fucks up everything he touches. Deal with it, Kenny. The way I see it, Ben still has a chance to make things right. If he wants it. How about it, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Clementine's one of the few. I'm thinking what's gonna happen in the next episode. <laughs> stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. I hope I don't cry just like I did. <laughs> you owe it to her to stand up for her now. You're right. I know it's a spoiler, but at this point, when you know, saw me bite. But I wanna do it. For you me. know what's gonna happen to me. I gotta make it right with him. Somehow, I gotta make it right. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? If someone was gonna take it, they'd have done it already. Besides, what choice do we have? I was just take, taking a battery at least or something. Just in case something happens, you know? God damn it, Lean. <laughs> One of the other reasons I thought of this game because how emotional it gets at some points, and especially, I mean, it's, if you guys, everything this game is old. This is twenty twelve, I think. Every almost half the people, everyone will know what happens to Lee, and how the story plays out, and it's so emotional, so beautiful. One of the main reasons why I decided to play this game because. The decisions each individual makes. Where the hell are they? It's interesting. Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Yeah. Vernon, get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. I mean, the one that took it, did he? Ooh, boy. That's a lot of dead people. Oh damn! I went to the supermarket. Are, are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, son of a bitch! Holy! Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine, but if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully.
time left. God, I'm going to cry in that episode. <laughs> I know I am. Oh. Around every corner. You killed the boy in the attic. You did not. Uh, I I would have killed the boy. I'm going to put this headphones on. It makes it better with the sound. I would have killed the boy, but when Kenny said, I don't know if I can do it again, that's when I was telling you about in the last video. I, you know, you know, when the parents carried killing the kid and all that. Uh, I like Kenny because I want him to build the experience of this. I'm not saying like, oh, you better, you should get used to killing the kids. No, it's the responsibility. It's the obligation of doing that. I mean. the process of healing, you know? I've done it once, I can do it again. It's just something I got to, I gotta do, you know? If, if any, any of it makes sense, what I'm trying to say. Uh, do you like or turn burn? I mean, I done it. I tried to threaten him and all that, but it always ends up killing me. So I didn't. I didn't know any other way. I prob probably there is. I'm just did it wrong. But I mean, I had no point to lie to him except maybe for the kid part. But it's whatever at that point, you know. Uh, did you bring Clementine to Crawford with you? Yes, I did. It's a 50-50, and the reason, you know, I brought it, it's not because of the story, because I don't think there's any story to it at all. I mean, we had little moments here and there to talk about, but it's not really that much to talk about. Um, one, you know, if for me, the, if there was a real situation, if for me, the turns, and Clementine's all by herself, defenseless, yeah, I'm not doing that. And also, Clementine has helped me up in the past so many times, so... I would I help me as much as possible, you know. Did you let Ben fall to his death? No. And some people, a lot of people, someone did. The reason I did it and have never done it before is because, even though I say a lot of bad things about Ben and all that, I get it. He's a kid. He's still a teenager. Uh, even though I trusted him with, you know. Clam, protect Clam and all that. He freaks out. He's so, he's still a teenager. He's like Clementine. He, they're still kids. They're not gonna freeze up. I taught Ben. I mean, I taught Ben. I taught Clam not to freeze up, to do this, to do that. Nobody really taught Ben. Every assumes Ben like Ben. You are you're an, you're an adult. You should know better. But to think about it, he's still a child. And I, some people might disagree with that. I met people. I have discussed this many times with people. Not about Ben, about some people uh, who are like, who are teenagers and they do like adult stuff but then they do something bad and I just say, well, because he's a kid. That's how I view it personally. Like, um, he's still a kid. He's, he's still gonna do like kid mistakes even though he's just working as an adult or does adult stuff. That's how I view Ben, really. He's still a kid. That's why he's gonna slip up and do Super stuff like the fuck ups he did. So uh, that's how I, I view Some people will disagree with me, and those are the ones, the ones 50%. But yeah. What was the last? Did you review your Batmatu group? Oh, that was a lot of people that did. I mean, it's at, that, at some point you're gonna notice like I'm starting to pay, I'm starting to do this. What's the point of hiding it? So. And, you know, I've been honest with Ken, my lovely boy, so I gotta be honest with him. I'm surprised with Chris and me, like, really? We barely built a relationship. Well, sure, why not help me out? Hey, what? Oh, I don't know. But this is the last of it. Alrighty, guys. This was episode four of The Walking Dead. 
please enjoy this episode. Enjoy all the episodes I've done and every single video I've done in the past from the Comic Con video to God of War and, and The Walking Dead and all that. Like I keep saying, like I said, I'll be, I'll be saying this for the next few videos. Right now, we're not doing good. We're doing terrible. And I'll probably play different games here and there. Probably the next video will be something different, not The Walking Dead or God of War related. But yeah, um, like I said, I want the channel to grow, really. And I know it's going to take time. I've been doing this for two years. But um, how do I say this? I, I, like, I don't have a script for this at all. At all. Um, you know, I always say, and I really do mean it, you guys are everything to me. And those that comment, you know, I can I can tell that you're the ones that watch the end of the video. Thank you so much. I appreciate all of that. Thank you. And of course, you know, I always reply to you in the comments. And like I said before, I would love this to be my career. Hopefully one day that will happen, but I need your guys' help for that. And once that happens, kind, kind, kindness will pay it forward, you know? I'll do something for you guys one day, and vice versa, you know? Oh, the relationship here, build the community, the members of pool, and all that. <laughs> but in order for, you, for that to happen, you guys gotta like, subscribe, share the video, comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what I'm doing wrong. Let me know if you guys want me to do something. Let me know if some, there's something you want me to review. Let me know if there's a game you want me to play. Um, whether it be a PC or a PlayStation, I'll try to see what I can do about it. I promise I will. But in the meantime, we got to do this. I, I need feedback, guys. I need to know what's going on. So we can grow together. But yeah. Thank you so much for everything, guys. Thank you for those 21 subscribers who still uh, are sticking with me. Like I said in the last video, unfortunately, we lost a member. That's sad, but um, I gotta move on. I mean, thank for if if you're still watching, thank you for being uh, a subscriber. I'm sorry that uh, I wasn't able to accommodate you. That I wasn't able to um, smile and all that. Uh, hopefully, you'll come back. Uh, he or she. Uh, but thank you for your time and thank you for subscribing. Thank you so much. Hopefully you will come back and uh, bring some more people. <laughs> but yeah, this is Mark Poole signing out. Hey guys, I just noticed this part. I just clicked away so that way I can get the video process and all that. But hmm. Interesting. No, that's all. Bye-bye. <laughs>